Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem and here we have minus 7 to the power of m equals to 7 and we solve this problem for the values of m. So here we solve this problem for two methods. So now here first we discuss our method 1. So in method 1 uh, here first uh, we use the nice exponential law and uh, we separate these two values. So first we rewrite this equation as minus 1 times of minus 1 multiplied by 7 and its whole power m equals to 7 and after that we use here the nice exponential law and you know that if we have a multiplied by b and its whole power m so it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by b to the power of m so now we use here this nice exponential law in the left hand side of this term and we write it as minus 1 to the power of m multiplied by 7 to the power of m equals to 7. So here uh, we know that by uh, Euler's theorem uh, or uh, we know that by Euler's identity. Uh, so the Euler identity uh, in a trigonometric ratio form is written as e to the power of iota pi. Okay, so e to the power of iota pi and plus 1 equals to 0. So, uh, this means that over uh, uh, here you just find the value of e to the power of iota pi and we know that e to the power of iota pi equals to minus 1. So, here we use this nice Euler's identity and we get the value of e to the power of iota pi it is equals to minus 1. So now here we replace this minus 1 by e to the power of iota pi and so that it will be written as in this form e to the power of <coughs> iota pi and its whole power m multiplied by 7 to the power of m equals to 7. So now in the next step here we again use the nice exponential law. So these exponents are multiplied by each other and we write it as e to the power of iota m pi multiplied by 7 to the power of m equals to 7. So uh, now here uh, we need to take the log on both of the sides. So uh, here we take this log on both of the sides and it will be written as e to the power of iota m pi multiplied by 7 to the power of m equals to log of 7. So here we use the nice property of logarithm and we know that if we have log a multiplied by b so then we write it as log of a plus log of b. So now we use this nice property in the left hand side of this equation so that its left hand side will be written as log of e to the power of iota m pi plus log of 7 to the power of m equals to log 7. So uh, in the next step here we again use the property of log and we move this exponent in the front of this log and it will be written as iota m pi into log e and plus here we again use the property of log and we move this m in the front of this log and it will be written as log 7 equals to log 7. And here we know that uh, the value of log e equals to 1. So it will be written as iota pi into m plus m into log 7 equals to log 7. So here you see that uh, we have m be the common term. So that we take common m here and we get uh, iota pi plus log of 7 equals to log of 7. So now we move this iota pi, uh, this whole term to the right hand side and it will be written as m equals to log of 7 divided by iota pi plus uh, log of 7. So this is the final answer of this question. And now uh, we move towards the second method. So so in method 2 first we copy down the given question statement and now we again rewrite this equation as minus 1 multiplied by 7 and its whole power m equals to 7. 
so here we know that iota equals to square root of minus 1 and iota square equals to minus 1 so now we replace this minus 1 equals to iota square so that uh, this equation will be written as iota square multiplied by 7 and its whole power m equals to 7 and now we uh, again use the nice property of exponential law so we separate this uh, exponent to both of these terms and it will be written as iota square and its whole power m into 7 to the power of m equals to 7 so uh, this will be written as uh, iota to the power of 2m multiplied by 7 to the power of m equals to 7 and here we again use uh, log on both of the sides and it will be written as log of iota and its whole power 2m multiplied by 7 to the power of m equals to log 7. So now uh, we use the nice property of log and we separate these two terms and we write it as log iota 2 power m plus log of 7 to the power of m equals to log 7. So now in the next step we again use the property of log and we move this exponent to the front of this log and it will be written as 2m into log of iota plus here we move this m uh, to the front of this log and it will be written as m times of log 7 equals to log 7. So uh, in the next step uh, you see here we have m be the common value here so that we take common m and the remaining terms are 2 times of log iota plus log of 7 and this whole equals to log of 7. So now uh, because uh, here in this part we need to find the value of m so that we divide both of the sides by 2 log iota plus log 7 and it will be written as m times of 2 log iota plus log 7 divided by 2 times of log iota plus log 7 and this whole equals to log 7 divided by log iota 2 log iota plus log 7 so in the next step you see here these whole term is cancelled out by this whole term and we write it as m equals to log 7 divided by 2 times of log iota plus log 7. So this is the value of m and this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.